difficult but at the same time it's not too difficult. Mainly the hardest part about this map is the first half due to the maze to the silver key. Although that maze really isn't too difficult in terms of navigating it because most of the side hallways that take you off the main path they don't go too far off the main path. There's not, it's not like there's like other like ways to get down there as well like how it was in 428 where it's like different hallways take you to more hallways. It's not more so that, it's more so the fact that there's a lot of intersections and stuff you come to in that maze where multiple guards can see you from different spots. So trying to, you know, avoid them, but at the same time, they can go walking down the hallway further down, you not knowing where they go, and that could make it even tougher. That's what's pretty much the tough part. I mean, the, the last part of this map really isn't that difficult, and... But, but the thing is, it, it's weird because there's a lot of side rooms, but they're not really that rewarding. It's like you open up a door, and it's like a guard or two, and one piece of treasure, or something like that. It's just really weird, so that the side areas really aren't that rewarding. So it's like, why even have them in the first place? It's like, you could have probably like done something else with them to make this map a little more interesting. Oh boy, but yes, I mean, it did finally tone down on the mutants at least, 448. Let's go on to 449. Oh yeah, and there's eight secrets in this map also, like there was in 447. Let's go to 449. We're almost to floor 50, which is our next boss battle, so one more floor and then we will be there. And until then guys, I am the Club of the Man, 1993.